get ready for a new show. The adventure of your people that started a long time ago. Legendary characters. Shalom, Khaberim. Hi, friends. How are you? Can you say, Shalom, Miss Eve? Shalom. It's time to continue our story. The story of Passover, the story of Pesach. The sto and so Moshe decided to be brave. Everybody show me a brave pose. Tough. And off he went to tell King Pharaoh, to tell Paro, Shlachna et ami, let my people go. Oh, listen, oh, listen, King Paro. Oh, listen, oh, listen, please listen. Let my people go, they work so hard all day, they want to go away. King Paro, King Paro, what do you say? No, 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 I will not let them go. No, 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 I will not let them go. And so Moshe took his rod, his walking stick, and just as God had told him, he threw it on the ground and it became a snake. Can you hiss like a snake? Hiss. But Pharaoh said, my magicians can also do that. And so they did. They turned their staffs, their rods into snakes. But Moshe's snake ate them all. And Moshe took it and became a rod again in his hand. Hmm. Maybe we need to try again. Maybe with a different tune. Join us. Oh, listen, listen, King Paro, let my people go. Oh, listen, listen, King Paro, Shlachna et ami. They work so hard all day, they want to go away. So, King Paro, what do you say? Shlachna et ami. No, no, no. I will not let them go. Listen, listen, King Paro, let my people go. Listen, listen, King Paro, Shlachna et Ami. It's time to go away. They want to be free. Oh, King Pharaoh, what do you say? Shlachna et Ami. No, no, no. I will not let them go. Paro didn't listen, so God sent ten plagues, Esther Makot, ten warnings and ten punishments. And it started slowly. First, dam, the river turned into blood. You couldn't drink from it. Ugh. No, you couldn't use it. Paro did not listen, so the second plague was Tsefardea. Can you jump like a frog and go, rabbit, rabbit? There you go. Walk in his bed, there were frogs on his bed and frogs on his head, frogs on his nose and frogs on his nose. Frogs here, frogs there, frogs were jumping everywhere. So Paro said, Stop, stop the frogs, stop the frogs, go away, but stop those froggy jumping frogs. So the plague stopped. But then Paro changed his mind. The plague went away, but you will stay. Na 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 na. Another plague, and the next one we're gonna do is kinim, lies. You know it's very itchy. Can you scratch your head? Can you scratch your shoulders? Can you scratch your belly button? Scratch, scratch, scratch. One morning when Paro woke up in his bed, there were lies in his bed and lies on his head. Lies on his nose and lies on his clothes. Lies here, lies there. Lies were itching everywhere. Paro said, All right, you may leave, but take these lies with you. So the plague stopped. And then Paro changed his mind. No, 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 you need to stay. I changed my mind. No, 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 no. Oh, so you know what? 
A row of wild beasts came. Can you roar like a lion? Roar! Tom. How about growl like a bear? Rawr. Or like a tiger? Lions and tigers and bears, oh my! One morning when Pharaoh woke up in his bed, there were wild beasts everywhere. Wild beasts on his window, wild beasts through his door. Wild beasts here, wild beasts there. Everyone give me a roar! Ay, mamita, stop that wild beast! Stop, stop the plague, you may go, but stop the plague, por favor, please, please, please. The wild beasts went away, but you're staying. You're not going. No way, Jose. <laughs> and we will do one more play now, which is Hoshech, darkness. So you can cover your eyes. And how many fingers am I holding? No, I'm not cheating. You're supposed to be covering your eyes. <gasps> okay, so yes, Hoshech. No one could see anything. It was dark. One morning, Mataro woke up in his bed. Notice that darkness was everywhere. Darkness here, darkness there. Darkness here, darkness there. Darkness, darkness everywhere. Stop the darkness! Go away, but stop the darkness! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! What? The plague stopped? Stay! <laughs> and there were ten plagues. Can you jump? 10 times while counting out loud with me. Let's start. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten plagues. Oh wow. And now can you jump while we count Beivrit in Hebrew? Achat, Shtaim, Shalosh, Arva, Chamesh, Shesh, Sheva, Shmone, Tesha, Eser. And is there another language you speak at home? French, Italian, Mandarin. What is it? Portuguese? Spanish, oh, like me. Okay, let's count in Spanish. Remember to jump. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve, diez. Until Perro finally said, go away, but go away quickly before I change my mind. Maher, fast, we need to pack, we need to leave Egypt. Oh, what should I bring? Um, a musical instrument? I don't know. Um, my swimsuit? No, what am I thinking? What I'm wearing? And if there was one thing you wanted to take out of Egypt with you, what would that be? We need to make some bread, right? But, but, but we don't have time. So, so let's make matzah instead. Make a matzah, fat, fat, fat. Do not make it fat, fat, fat. Make a matzah, fat, fat, fat. Just like that. Paro might change his mind. We need to do it maher, fast. Come on. Make a matzah, pat, pat, pat. Do not make it fat, fat, fat. Make a matzah, pat, pat, pat. Just like that. The matzah is flat, flat, flat. Like this. You see? No, no, no. But just in case, let's make it maher mehod very fast. Make a matzah, pat, pat, pat. Do not make it fat, fat, fat. Make a matzah, pat, pat, pat. Just like that. The matzah is flat, flat, flat. Make a matzah, pat, pat, pat. Make it fat, pat, pat, pat. Make a matzah, pat, pat, pat. Okay, so we walk, we walk, and 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 we walk out of Egypt, and we walk, walk with me, we walk, and... Oi, 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 oi! I spy, with my little eye, something cajol, something blue. See? See what I see? I see, you see. Do you see what I see? If you see what I see, it's the sea, it's the sea that I see. Do you see that I see the sea? Oh, it's the yam. The Yam Suf, the Sea of Reeds, also known as the Red Sea. Oh, and I forgot to pack my swimsuit. Wait, what am I saying? This is too gadol, this is too big. There's no way we can swim in there. Um, what do we do? Do we go back? Okay, let's try. Oh, yo, yo, yo. Oh, yo, yo, yo. Come on with me. Oh, yo, yo, yo. We can't go back. See there? There, Paro changed his mind and he's coming with his army. He's coming after us. Oh, what are we going to do? We can't move forward. We can't go back. So the people of Israel prayed to God, the creator of the world, and they said, Please, God, Bevakasha, help us. And God told Moshe, Grab your stick and touch the water. 
and I will blow a strong wind, a strong ruach. Can you blow a strong wind with me? <sighs> and just as God blew that strong wind, the waters parted with one wall of water on one side and another wall of water on the other side. And there was a path right there leading us to freedom, but it was a little bit scary. Can you show me scared? Mm. I don't know. I don't know if I can go. I mean, what if the water, what if that wall of water, something happens? I don't know how to swim. I don't. The tale goes that all of a sudden, a very brave man called Nachshon, can you show me brave, said, I am going. And he started to go and he said, I trust God. And this is our path to freedom. So everybody, let's walk with Nachshon through the parted waters, through the parted sea. Now let's walk with Nachshon together. <laughs> my little eye that the waters, the Mayim, closed. And so Paro and his people couldn't reach us. We were finally free. And Miriam, Moshe's sister, his achot, took her tambourine. Can you take your tambourine or your favorite musical instrument? People of people Israel, Israel, we are we finally, are finally free. free. We get to work, but also to rest. We get to play, to be with our mishpacha, with our family, and with our chavarim, with our friends. So I, Miriam, ask you to please bring your musical instruments. I have my tov, my tambourine of simcha, of happiness. So people of Israel, let's dance, let's sing, let's celebrate together. Dai, 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 For thousands of years, we celebrate Passover, Pesach, 
with a special meal called a seder or a seder. Chag Sameach, Haberim! Happy Passover! Make sure you watch the first part of this story. That link and other video links you can find in the description section below. Shalom. Thank you for watching, Haverim. Don't forget to subscribe. And please, Bevakasha, share it with your friends, your Haverim, and with your Mishpacha, your family. Tada! Thank you. Shalom. <laughs>